have thought you'd be asleep already. And I you. I was helping Alice with the problem, and now I can't sleep. She wanted your opinion then? Yes. Can we pick up where we left this morning? I'd prefer to think about my answer for a bit longer. There's already so much we need to think about every day. One of us might forget if we wait too long. Marriage seemed a convenient solution. <laughs> Whether you were a spouse or an apprentice, you'd be living with me. I thought it would be less bothersome and more efficient if one person filled both roles rather than two. Are you disappointed? No, that's pretty much the answer I was expecting. Is that so? Pretty much. However, an apprentice's journey ends with them leaving their master. You became my master of human ways. And I have learned much under your tutelage. Then you chose to leave, but you also chose to return to me. And I couldn't let you go. Not again. So the next morning I claimed you as my bride, and that was that. Married couples are supposed to stick together, after all. Actually, marriage isn't nearly that black and white anymore. Hmm. It's pretty normal for couples to get divorced nowadays. But even if we are master and apprentice, or a married couple, they're just types of roles we take. Roles? Whether it's family, friends, or colleagues, people have all kinds of relationships and roles within them. Some of those roles are chosen, some are given, and others are ones we wish the other person would take on. And each person has their idea of what those roles are and what names they want to use for them. Master and apprentice and married couple are the roles we've chosen to take on at this point. But I don't think we need to stick to them if they stop being something we want. <sighs> Is this your way of telling me that you don't appreciate being assigned the role of my bride or my master in our relationship? That's not what I meant. I do appreciate those roles, in fact. I kind of like them, too. It's just that... <sighs> we didn't start out in the best of way, but that doesn't matter, because whatever our roles, I'm happy that I'm with you. And hearing you say that you can't let me go makes me even happier. I wanted you to know that. What is happy? Uh, I, I'm not sure how to answer that. Uh, well, it's feeling like you can make it through another day. Like, as long as I have this memory, I can weather a hardship or two that might come my way. It's something that cheers me up. Makes my insides go, wah, too. Ugh. I see. So right now I feel happy that I got to speak with you, and I feel lonely about having to go back to bed. <laughs> I think it would also be true to say that I feel happy to have been able to take on the role of your husband. Is it alright for me to continue in this capacity? In all earnestness, I don't know what I would do if you were to say no. Only if I can continue to be your master as well. Yes. <laughs>